What's up guys, Weather Wednesday, coming at you with another Watcher of Realms video. And this weekend we've got a very special invocation of spirits. We have a chance of getting our hands on Hex and Fiercy. Now Hex was actually the second hero that I ever pulled on my account. And he's amazing. He's an amazing guild boss hero. And he does a lot more than that, but he's amazing on my guild boss team. And Fursi is a pretty good healer. Uh, if I were being honest, I'd rather get uh, A1 on my Hex than I would to get a Fursi. But a Fursi wouldn't be bad to get on my Hex. And if we're being really honest, I probably won't get anything, but you just never know. But before we do that... We've got five chances with our red crystals. Let's get into it. Starting off with a Nero. And we get Idril, okay. So I've had Idril A5 for quite some time. And she is amazing, but I'll be exchanging that. See if we can get anything new here today. And we get ourselves an autumn. I am just starting to build my autumn. I got her up to level 50, I think. Doradil, okay. Once again, we have got nothing out of our red crystals. No surprise, I don't have any of the big boys. So we'll just get into our blues. We're not wasting diamonds this weekend because I just don't have enough to even think about doing that. Nor am I anywhere near Mercy because last weekend I pulled Regulus at the end. So start off with a blue tax because I always start off with blue tax and I often start off with the double blue tax. This shouldn't come as a surprise by now, but it's still disappointing. We got here a triple blue tax to start off this amazing shard pulling video. Will I hit the quad? This is an epic. We get a Theowin. Pick up our rewards. I should be able to do another 10 pull. After I get everything here. Anything in here? Nope. Uh, we'll get that. see here not gonna rank too well when I don't pull anything good okay this is where we get our extra crystals and we'll have at least one more 10 pull but really the only reason why I'm pulling this weekend is because I needed these flat off shards because I don't have him so I am going for this fusion. Thankfully, these fusions are so incredibly easy. Okay, we get one more 10 pull and then a couple more pulls after that. See if we have any chance of getting lucky. It's another blue tax. So I am paying an incredible amount of taxes today. Couple more blue crystals. Get ourselves some food, I guess. Yeah. So all that for, what did I get? One single epic? Two if you, if you include the red crystals. So, 
big surprise, right? Let's see how many diamonds I got out of that. Whopping 900 extra diamonds. And I got some food. You know, that's honestly about what I expected. Because that's about what I pull. I go into Mercy just about every time. So now I'm... But another, uh, a third of the way <laughs> toward my next mercy. Uh, that's a big surprise. But I do have some good news on my account. Uh, my guild boss team is starting to get there. Uh, on Nightmare 3, I just got 15,000 blood. So we're getting really close to that last reward. And on my Nightmare 4 team, it's dying a little too fast, uh, but I got the second reward for the first time. I'll show you my main damage dealers. Uh, we got Zilla 2, Valeria, Hex. Those were, I think, the first three heroes on my account. And then Cetra. So I'm just doing the Laurel Rage Regen comp. And my Nightmare 3 team has the same comp with my main damage dealers being Zilla 2, Hex, Cetrum, and Valeria. Uh, Wrath doesn't get very much damage because he's not in there for very long. He's just kind of a filler piece if somebody dies or after I pull a Laurel or a Volca, I'll throw him in there for a little bit. But he's just, he's there just because. Um, maybe I should replace him with Abomination, I don't know. You let me know if you like Wrath or Abomination in there better. I'll show you my heroes. So, I wasn't really hurting for, like, I didn't really need a Legendary all that bad. Because what I really need on my account is better gear. So, did I really need to, you know, level up another hero when I can't even equip like, my Kriya is so poorly built. Uh, Cratch has nothing on. Uh, Regulus, I haven't... You know, I got him up to 60 just probably yesterday, but he has nothing. He has no gear. But most of my legendaries have gear. My Ezrin doesn't currently have gear. My Absin is built terribly. Uh, but I, I spent... A few days ago, I completely re-geared my entire account. So we've got Cetrum pretty well built, Valeria pretty well built. Pretty well, basically meaning with the gear that I have. Yeah, they could all be much better. Zilla 2, Comet. Unfortunately, he's a little slow right now, but he's still an amazing hero. Uh, Volca. We got Alistar built. I don't know how good he really is. Let me know where you're using him. You know, I went for the fusion. I don't know how useful he'll be to my account. I haven't used him much yet. Uh, we got Cerberus. I got him built a little bit better, so he's not dying quite so fast. Uh, Alora is a very good hero that I need to get her better built. Um... Razak is nice. Uh, Abomination. You know, I fused him real quick on my account, and he's pretty helpful. Uh, Absin, I haven't really used him a whole lot yet, so let me know if you have a good use for him. Brokir is amazing. If you pull him, build him right away. He's an amazing tank. Uh, I pretty much use him and Olog for all of my tank needs. Uh, Venema, I really don't understand how to use Venema. I need to, I need to learn how to use her better. Uh, I pretty much just use her because, uh, she is the Lord for Comet, so I use them in tandem a lot, but I could probably, I could probably take better advantage of having her, uh, Ezrin. I know that some people said there are some uses for him, but I have got no gear for him right now. So there's not much I can do with him. Uh, Cratch. 
I built him this high just because, uh, well, I mean, for the faction or whatever, but no, it's not like I'm going to use him anywhere, really. Uh, Kriya, I don't think I really need her. Uh, I think you know, she's like a worse version of Comet. Uh, Regulus is nice that I added him last weekend to my account. Uh, I'm sure I'll find some use for him, but because I already used Rokir and Olog, like, I don't know if he's better in some situations because I haven't tried him at all. But he's a really cool looking hero. <laughs> if nothing else, he looks cool. Um, you know, I've got... I've got the best, you know, epic heroes built for my use. You know, Mari, Idril, Wrath, Hollow, Greed, Maul, Vortex. I mean, I got, I have almost every epic in the game. Um, Current Fusion is one that I don't have, so I'm definitely going for that. Uh, Pyros, Dolores. Laurel. I mean, I don't even know if I really needed to put make Laurel a level 60. I've got her to A5, and I got some tanky gear on her just so she can survive when I need her to. Uh, Lightlock. Baron. Deimos I don't have any gear for. Rian I don't have any gear for. Maiden, some pretty poor gear. Imani, I would like to gear... <laughs> I'd like to gear a lot of these champions. You know, Eon was my first fusion, and I still haven't fully built her. Never used her, really, outside of the faction, and there's no gear for her. Uh, and after that, you know, I'm just starting to... I'm running out of, you know, uh, heroes to level up, so I'm just kind of leveling up whoever. I need to get Lunaria up to 60. Uh... I'd like to use her some more. And then everybody else. Aatrox. He's built pretty poorly right now. Gluttony I just pulled last weekend. So I'd like to get him going. And then just kind of. A bunch of whatever heroes. So I'm going to have to. I guess I need to get my. Eowyn. Uh, awakened. Oh, I guess that's only my second Theoin. Interesting. So we will awaken him. And then we'll get rid of our age roll. And that's it. That's where I'm at. You know, I didn't pull anything this weekend. That's fine. Because I already had Hex. It would have been nice to get an A1 Hex, but... You know, that wasn't ever very likely. So, hopefully, uh, hopefully next weekend I pull something. You never know. That's it. Thanks for watching. I'm Wilder Wednesday. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button. And I'll check you out next time for more Watcher of Realms content.